drama, crazy drama. And we, he just called my crib one night and was just like, yo, man, you think the game make a nigga soft? I was like, no doubt. <laughs> no doubt. The game make a nigga soft, man. Uh, game make a nigga soft, man. Nigga could play you. You can't even punch a nigga in the face like you could back in the days when a nigga disrespect you. Just, just straight beat the nigga down. And it, that just be that. Nigga, I put my hands on a nigga. I'm going to jail. I'm making the papers. And I'm getting sued. That's fucked up. That's fucked up. From a nigga straight playing me. He could just straight play me on some disrespectful shit. And I can't even wear him out the way I want to. Because I got mad repercussion behind it. And, and it ain't got no repercussion behind the dude. It's strictly the press and the media and the fans. And it's ridiculous, man. Ridiculous. That's a fucked up situation to be. Shout out to Big, man. And he was spitting knowledge in his 20s, early 20s. You know, that was a recording session between him and Tracy Lee when they uh, had to keep your hands up high. You know, when you transition to the industry, you know, you got to change the way you move. Like, I never understood why people made fun of rappers for having security. Like, you, you remember that J-Bar when he said, I shoot you, I'm brainless. You shoot me, you're famous. What's a nigga to do? Like, you know... They're already uh, objectifying masculinity in the many media anyway. So, you know, nowadays you just got to move different. You know, I know a lot of y'all saw that incident with Mike Tyson when he beat up a fan on a plane. Then the video came out that the fan was antagonizing him. You know, luckily he got off on that. But, you know, majority of the times they don't be lucky like that. So, and, um, definitely want to shout out Young Guru for putting out that audio for sure. You know, hopefully... Anything else big gotten uh, the storage will come out. So if you like the video, make sure you like and subscribe.